is our first square root equation. Now remember, if you've watched any of the previous videos on square roots and how to handle these, they're very easy. This is actually really easy marks. What you want to do is you want to get the square root alone. So here the square root already is by itself. Then you just want to square both sides. In maths you can do that as long as you do it to both sides. Now the square of a square root cancels out the square root and so you're just left with x plus 3. And then on the right you're left with 16. Then you simply go ahead and solve and you'd end up with x equals to 13. What's very important with square root equations is you should always check your answer. The reason is, is that square roots can sometimes give you a error on the calculator, so you have to check it. The way that you check it is the following. You take the answer and you plug it into the equation wherever you see x. So let's just quickly say left hand side is going to be 13 plus 3 uh, now that's equal to the square root of 16, which is 4. And the right-hand side, well, that's just a 4. So is the left-hand side the same as the right-hand side? Yes. So this answer works.